Let's be clear about the premise of this column. Assessing which of the NFC's fringy, for lack of a better word, teams are to be trusted most as they make a playoff push. How to define fringy. Not the Green Bay Packers or the New Orleans Saints, teams that have already clinched playoff berths. Green Bay locked up the NFC North by beating the Lions. While the Saints' two-game lead in the NFC South, with three to play, feels fairly secure. Get well soon. Please, Drew Brees. We're talking about the inscrutable here. Like the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, a super team that can lose to the Chicago Bears one week, demolish the Packers the next, and then have a halting victory over the Minnesota Vikings on Sunday. What are they, really, and what can they be expected to do in the stretch run? The NFC is flush with teams like the Books, and because seven teams will make the playoffs from each conference this season, being on the fringe is not the worst place to be right now. After Sunday's games, which featured three head-to-head -head matchups of fringe teams, we have a better idea of who has the best chance to emerge from the pile and shift into the NFC's inner circle.